<laughs> We're going to talk about the muscle attachments of the humerus. Uh, this is an uh, anterior view of the left humerus. We know that because we see the lesser and greater tuberosities in the intertubercular group, so it is anterior. It faces like this, so it is the left humerus. Subscapularis, supraspinatus, infraspinatus, teres minor. Pectralis major, Latimus dorsi, Teres major, Deltoid, Deltoid, Caraco brachialis. Caraco brachialis. Brachialis. Medial head of triceps. Lateral head of triceps. Long head of triceps. Inserts into the infraglenoid tubercle of the uh, scapula. Okay. So, this is the medial epicondyle and lateral epicondyle of the humerus. Medial supracondylar ridge, lateral supracondylar ridge of the humerus. We've got some origins here. This is pronator teres. Pronator teres. Okay. From the medial epicondyle. Uh, yes, of course. Uh, from the medial epicondyle to the um, pronator tuberosity of the radius. Okay. Um, this is common flexor tendon. It has three muscles. This is Palmaris longus, flexor discharum superficialis, flexor carpi ulnaris. From the lateral supracondylar ridge of the humerus, we have two origins. This is brachioradialis to the base of the stylet process of the radius. And this is extensor carpi radialis longus. Both from the lateral supracondylar ridge of the humerus, from the lateral epicondyle of the humerus, we have the common extensor tendon. Of course, it has many muscles. Below the extensor carpi radialis longus, we have extensor carpi radialis brevis. This is supinator. Supinator goes uh, like this. Okay. Um, this is extensor distorum and extensor distorminomai. This is unconius. And this is extensor carpi ulnaris.